Hello, Martin here. These are my sketchbooks I use daily and I like and love to use them. They are very cheap, very thin paper, relatively thin paper for watercolor and ink drawing, a rough, more on the rougher side. They, you can buy them in a pack of two and then that's how they look when they are nice and clean and fresh and here is my actual one um, which I used since this year the 6th, 6th, 16th of June and the first thing is to make a mess on the first page so that you that you don't uh, that you don't do an art book out of it. That you use it as a sketchbook for experiments, for all day sketching, and not to make here in this book uh, nice drawings. Of course, I also have uh, bigger sketchbooks with thicker paper, and there I try more detailed, precise uh, drawings, but not but not in this one. So it's cool to have a very bad first page. And then I started with some studies, which is very useful. This is uh, what sketchbooks are for, in my opinion. And here are things I did in summer in Poland, raves and some buildings, more raves. Then we and then I did some different um, uh, drawings with uh, uh, studies about trees. Obviously, therefore, I use uh, this. Okay, didn't use it for a while, so. With a fountain pen with an extra fine nib. And for the shadows here, I take a brush pen and these are the most two, the most used tools in this uh, sketchbook. Some storks, studies about composition, uh, some rarely uh, portraits, figures more architecture and uh, here with uh, watercolor, colored with watercolor a cityscape just from uh, fantasy and more of these uh, portraits then it gets looser and minimalistic so I was looking how far can we go and then I'm back for more detailed faces, crowds. And then it's a typical street scene, something from real world, the most of it, but from a fantasy. And here, is a, here are some pages, it's a study about um, a short story, so not a graphic novel of course, but, uh, just a, a short story. And so I'm focused on the light and shadow and the composition, so not the details. And <coughs> as well I do this with, the, with this fountain pen with a waterproof ink in it. And I, do, I don't do any pencil drawing before, so I have to wet this. Okay. Uh, directly with this fountain pen. Let's zoom in a little bit. And so let's say two people together. Yes, sir. Big warm coat, it's getting colder, you know. Uh, 
And so here's the outline and after the outline I will I will concentrate on the shadows and this is the most fun to make it all black. And then I have here a, a woman with and she's standing more sideways and turning the head in his direction. And maybe yeah, she's drinking a cup of coffee or a glass of wine or what else. And maybe he have some letters here and reading newspaper and don't don't watching her. So now let's do the shadows. So the, let's see the, the lights from this side. So his uh, face is in the light. So the ears would be light and so and dark hairs. And then we have here the So let's um, the, the from the right side there is the light, and with all in all these uh, drawings, I only use these uh, totally black parts, the white parts, and in between there are some. Half tone parts with this line work. Yeah, and that's just a small example how I draw these. It's a fun to do this in the evening while watching something on a streaming platform. Okay, this for today. Just a short demonstration how useful uh, such a really uh, cheap uh, sketchbook can be with so much pages. It's about 250 pages, 56 I think. So this for now and hope to see you. Bye.